Well, it won't take too long to go through the youth intake this season, as we only have three players to look at, two top talents and one elite talent. Let's start with this fullback, Erit Torrent. Good marking, good tackling, spirited personality, decent mentals, decent physicals of course for a 15 year old, crossing and dribbling are not good enough, he's probably never gonna make it. David, an advanced playmaker on the right, okay, decent mentals, either footed which is great, good technique, passing, agility only 10, I think I'm gonna train him to play in midfield. And we have an elite talent, an advanced forward, Ian Diaz. He looks decent enough. His finishing is not great, passing 9. Dribbling first touch. Leadership of 14, okay. Flair is good. He's left-footed, balanced personality. He might make it as an advanced forward. So that's the youth intake day this season, but don't go anywhere. Today we're gonna face Manchester United in the Champions League. It should be fun. You should definitely watch this episode. Hey, welcome back to Valencia on FM24. In today's episode, we're going to cover four matches. We're going to start with this home game against the third place Barcelona. We're going to play Manchester United in the quarterfinals of the Champions League. And we're going to face Levante away from home in La Liga. Since the last time you were with me, we played a bunch of games and we almost had a perfect run. We lost only one match and that happened in extra time. So let's start with what happened after the last episode, an 8-0 home against Real Betis. It was 7-0 at half time. Hugo Duro with a brace, shoulder up with a hat-trick, Gluck and Naipan with a brace. We only scored once in the second half. We needed extra time to get past a bar in the fourth round of the cup. 3-2, shoulder up Hugo Duro and Naipan with uh, the winning goal. We needed extra time against Real Sociedad as well, but unfortunately we lost with the same result, 3-2, Hugo Duro and Todibo scoring for us, and unfortunately we got knocked out of the cup, so that's one trophy we won't be winning uh, this season. We followed by a bunch of games in which we didn't concede a single goal. 2-0 victory away at Espanyol, Sudakov and Pabuena, 7-0 away at Mallorca, Pabuena, Oscar Gluck with a brace, Becerra, Naipan, Dorgu and Anthony Robust is a youngster that I've promoted. We got revenge against the Real Sociedad in the league with 1-2-0, Dorgu and Hugo Duro. We were drawn against Lance in the round of 16 in the Champions League with one both games, 1-0 away from home, Luengo scoring a late goal and the 2-0 home victory, Duro and Bartolomi, another youngster that I've promoted to the first squad. But I believe you know him, he was promoted at the start of the season, a 2-0 victory away at Leganes in uh, the league, shoulder up with a brace, 2-0 against Girona, Todibo and Fresneda, two late goals to get us uh, this win, 2-0 at home against Elche, another two late goals from Becerra and Vaisek, and a 2-1 victory away at Getafe, Pedrola and Marcelo Luengo with another late winner. So judging by these last three games, I'm a little bit afraid of complacency. I mean, against Girona, we needed 82 minutes to score a goal, against Elche 72, and against Etafe, we scored an early goal, but we almost dropped two points here. It took uh, a late goal from Luengo to get us uh, all three points. So we've won every single game in the league, so that means now we're top of the league with six points clear of both Real Madrid and Barcelona. Villarreal couldn't keep up the pace, so we don't need to worry about them anymore. The quarterfinals of the Champions League, Valencia versus Manchester United, Arsenal, Liverpool, Bayern München against Chelsea and Real Madrid against Borussia Dortmund. But before we play Manchester United, there's a huge game against Barcelona that we need to go through. And you know what will really help? If you guys subscribe to the channel, of course. Now here's the first 11 that's gonna face Barcelona, Giorgi, Giascarlito, Todibo, Diomande, Fresneda, Vaisek, Naipan, Dominguez, Shelderup, Doak and Duro up front. We have a bunch of tired legs on the bench because a bunch of our players came back uh, really tired from their international duty like uh, Dorgu, Gluck, Sudakop and even Pabuena. With a win today we're gonna go 9 points clear of Barcelona and I believe for now they'll be out of the title race. They do have a strong squad, especially up front with Gavi, Pedri, Yamal and uh, the Brazilian elite striker Walmir, he's uh, a new gen. 
they still have friendly in the young and Ter Stegen. I believe their defense is not that strong, so maybe we can take advantage of that. Well, so far we're having a poor game. Nothing notable happened. We only had two shots, one on target. It was probably a long shot. No yellow cards, no nothing, no highlights, and it's nil nil at half time. Such a boring first half. I'm not happy with what's going on. We need to win this game. Come on, boys. Here we go. Nipan to shoulder up. Four minutes in the second half, and we have our first highlight of the game. Nipan to shoulder up. Vysek! What a huge opportunity. A chance for a counter attack now for Barcelona. Oh my word. Oh my word. This looks really dangerous. Fresneda was there, probably the end of the highlight. Great job, Fresneda. Here we go, a chance now maybe for Barcelona to create something. They didn't have a single shot. We get the ball back, here's a shelter up, shelter up. He keeps going, shoot dude! Oh, off target though. Yeah, no shots at all for Barcelona and only 36% possession. We should be winning this game, let's make some substitutions. I'm gonna bring in uh, Becerra for Ben Joke. Let's bring in Oscar Gluck for uh, Roberto Dominguez and uh, Sudakov. Yeah, they can play definitely for uh, 25 minutes or so. Oh my word, shoulder up is out injured. He was the only one that was playing all right. Foot injury, that's not good. We also have uh, Pedrola out injured. So I guess Mario Molnar is coming in. A draw would keep Barcelona six points behind us, but it will give a chance to Real Madrid to close the gap. It's only four points, Sudakov, come on, finally, 81 minutes on the clock, we finally score a goal, 1-0, come on, Sudakov, nicely done, it was a stupid mistake by their uh, defender there, but yeah, you need to clear the ball, dude, if we don't concede now, I'm gonna start wasting some time, here's the Lamin Yamal over the bar, yeah, let's do it right away, and play for set pieces. Was it over the bar? No, it's a corner. Come on, don't concede. Just Carlito does well there. Another cross. Safe hands from Georgie. Waste some time, dude. We're in stoppage time now. Five minutes added. Hugo Draw takes a free kick. Sudakov. Let's make it two and put this game beyond doubt. No, 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 no. Don't do it. Yes, Todibo. Nicely done. Vysek now to Oscar Gluck. Here's Diomande. Oh, so close there to Dibo. To Sudakov. Sudakov. That's poor. We still control the ball. Oscar Gluck. Come on. Oh, no. The referee is going to disallow it. I don't care as long as we don't get any more highlights and we win the game. No, it's goal awarded. It's 2 0. Come on, boys. Yes. 80 points for Valencia, 71 for Barcelona, we go 9 points clear of them. Our best performer, Hugo Duro, okay, with an assist. Well, I'm sorry to say, but Sheldrap will miss uh, the Champions League quarterfinals against uh, Manchester United. Pedro La is still out. So here's uh, the youngster that I promoted from our B squad. His name is Anthony Robust. He looks uh, decent, left-footed, fellow professional personality, wonder kid decent attributes for a 20 year old he's a little bit tired he's gonna play the first half i guess then i'm gonna bring in uh, mario molnar i guess or maybe becerra to play uh, on the left so we're gonna go with rest as in goal dorgu diomande Gatswil, fresneda vysek naipan gluck robust Doak, and duro the first leg takes place in spain at nuevo mestalla i told the players it's time to take revenge on Manchester United for what happened in the Champions League uh, final last season. They don't have uh, that Mexican striker up front anymore. Maybe he's injured, who knows. Let's see what's going to happen. Hopefully we're going to win this game and uh, go in England with a good chance to qualify to the semi-finals. Five minutes in, we have uh, Manchester United attacking and losing the ball. Dorgu does well there. Here's Oscar Gluck. Good ball to Hugo Duro. Duro. Duro still controls the ball. Oscar made it 1-0. His 10th goal of the season. Come on. But we need more. This is not enough. Dorgu takes a throw in. 10 minutes later, Diomande to Oscar Gluck. Nicely done, Hugo Duro. Duro, come on! 2-0, VAR is not checking anything, 
He's 2 0 after 17 minutes. Come on, let's smash Manchester United. Come on, boys. 2 0. We'll talk about efficiency. Two shots on target, two goals, a poor XG, but we're 2 0 up. Patrick Dorgu took a yellow card. Gluck and Duro creating both goals. That was lovely from them. And uh, it's half time, I guess. Not yet. We still have one more highlight to go in the last minute of this first half. Ben Doak over the bar, though. It comes to nothing. We should sub off Robust, who, who is really tired. Yeah, you're doing brilliantly. Keep it up. Let's bring in uh, Mario Molnar. Fresneda with a free kick. Come on, boys. Can we make it free? Oscar. Doak. Or at least don't concede. Oh, Ben Doak. Come on. Only his fourth of the season, though. He hasn't been that great uh, as last season. Last season was his uh, year, that's for sure. Oscar Gluck nicely done there with another assist. What a lovely shot from uh, Ben Dog to make it 3-0 against Manchester United. If we don't concede, we're going to qualify. Who's going to take this free kick? Oscar Gluck, of course. Right here, dude. Right here. And make it 4-0. Come on. Oh, lovely, lovely move there. Mario Molnar over the bar. He scored a couple of goals on his debut, Mario Molnar, with two long shots. Yeah, 60 minutes on the clock. And uh, let's make some substitutions. As I saw Vaisek on a yellow card and not doing too well. So uh, Luengo is coming in. We should sub off Patrick Dorbiu as well. Should I bring in David Yeg or should I play it safe? Yeah, let's play it safe. Just Carlito is coming in. And uh, that's all for now. Another free kick. This time Hugo Dro is going to take it. He's going to get a cross in. Just Carlito just came in. Come on. To make it 4-0. And we are smashing Manchester United. Great job. 20 minutes remaining. We're going to score another one. There's plenty of time. Let's praise them. Come on. It's 4-0 against Manchester United. Talk about revenge. Nike Pan gets subbed off and uh, Sudakov comes in. He was pretty tired. Here's Fresneda with a throw in. Seven minutes remaining from a, a regular time. Fresneda. Fresneda tries the low cross. That was poor. A chance for a counter attack now for Manchester United. Oh, Taylor does so well there. Block him. Do not concede, please. Fresneda did so well there. They still control the ball, though. Another opportunity. Taylor was there, a chance for a counter-attack maybe for us. I don't think that was the highlight. We lose the ball. Come on, Hugo Duro. Should have done better there. And uh, now Tomiyasu, yeah, who plays for Manchester United this day. Rashford hits the post. Such a huge opportunity. Such a huge opportunity. We got away with it. It's not over yet. Come on. And the fucking highlight already. Doke, that's the end of it. Okay. We got away with that one, that's for sure. Do not concede, please. Come on. Just a few more minutes. Luengo. Oh, Luengo, dude. What the hell, man? Okay, we got away with it again. What an impressive display by the boys. 4-0 against Manchester United in the first leg. The best performer, Oscar Gluck, of course. Time to play Levante away from home with George Ingold, Dorgu, Todibo, Gatswil, Cuesta, Luengo, Dominguez, Sudakov. Robust, Becerra and Duro up front. I've rested a few players. Dorgu's going to play because he's going to be suspended for the second leg against Manchester United. Of course, we're favourites to win uh, this game. We're favourites in most games uh, in uh, La Liga. It's not going to be an easy game, though. Levante sit uh, ninth in uh, the league. Hopefully, it's going to be a fun game and uh, we're going to get all three points. Here's Hugo Duro with our first highlight, taking a corner for Dorgu. Okay, over the bar, though. Two more minutes from this first half and we get our second highlight of the game. And we lose the ball. It's uh, Levante's uh, time to attack. They controlled possession. They had over 60%. A good chance here and what a huge opportunity. Oh my word. Nil-nil at half time? Yeah, nil-nil at half time. It was a poor half for us. 30 minutes remaining. Let's make substitutions. I don't like what I'm seeing from these people. I'm going to bring in Ben Doak, Mario Molnar, Fabier Babuena. Pedrola is on the bench, but I don't want to risk him. Oscar Gluck is coming in for Roberto Dominguez, and let's switch him with Sudakov. Here's Todibo. 
20 minutes remaining. God's will. God will uh, have been playing all right. He played all right against Manchester United too. Tordi Ball, Sudakov now. Lovely ball. Pabuena. Pabuena. Come on. His fifth of the season. Come on, boys. 20 minutes remaining. We're in front. Oh, but we got ourselves a kickoff highlight. This is not ideal. Maybe we're going to get the ball back and make it two. Do not equalize immediately, please. Dorgu, okay, we get the ball back. That's what we wanted. Georgie, dude, come on, Georgie. Come on, Georgie. 1-1 one, one from the kickoff highlight. What a mistake from our goalkeeper there. Yeah, we're in stoppage time. No other highlights. And we dropped two points away at Levante. This is not good. Unfortunately, another player got injured, just Carlito for around four weeks. We have Patrick Dorgu suspended for this match. And even though we have a 4 0 advantage, I'm gonna go in the second leg with some of our best players. Rest is in goal, Yeg on the left because I don't have a choice. Todibo, Diomande, Fresneda. I'm gonna keep Luengo in the first 11. Napan, Gluck, Robust because, again, I don't have a choice. Doak and Duro up front. Make sure you approach this match with nothing less than 100% focus. That's what you always need to tell the players after a 4-0 uh, win in the first leg. They play a 4-4-2 now with uh, Jimenez, the Mexican striker up front. I think we're gonna qualify. Come on, we have a 4-0 advantage. Our first highlight with us attacking. Okay, that's good. Uh, oh, so close from uh, Hugo Duro. Good cross there from Yeig. Corner now for Manchester United, 10 minutes in, so close from Tomiyasu. Here's Fresneda to Ben Dog. now Luengo, 30 minutes on the clock. Judging by the match that Manchester United are in control of uh, this first half. Jimenez, this guy is really dangerous. Rashford now, Rashford cutting inside, he's still... João Pedro now, stop him. Stop it, Manchester United. Good save there from Restes. He's uh, on a 7 rating. Mason Mount takes uh, the corner. Do not concede before half time, please. Another good save from Restes. Oh my word, they are piling on the pressure here. They are looking for that opening goal. They are looking for the goal. And... Oh, what a huge opportunity again. Oh my word, they were all over us. We got away with it. Yeah, take a look at the match stats. 11 shots, 4 on target for Manchester United with a decent XG. Good possession. We didn't have a single shot on target. Right, it's half time and we need to be better in front of goal. Right, we have a free kick now. Can't we FM them? Who's gonna take it? Probably Oscar Gluck. No, it's Luengo. Okay, kid. Right here. Right here. Top beans. Come on, you can do it. You've scored before, so close. Here's Yeg to Naipan, long ball to no one. Hugo Duro was there, but couldn't jump for it. Now maybe a chance for uh, Manchester United. Mason Mount, we're 1-0 down. 49 minutes on the clock. There's still time, but come on, there's not going to score three more. I don't think it's going to happen. 30 minutes remaining. After this highlight, I'm going to make some substitutions. A free kick now. Robust to Oscar. Nicely done. Ben Dog. Ben Dog. You had a chance to play to Robust, dude. Fresneda. Fresneda. Good cross. Robust. Naipan. Good duro. Ben Dog. Ben Dog scores against Manchester United. Here's a former Liverpool player. And it's 1-1. 58 minutes on the clock. Maybe it's time to make some substitutions. Rest some of these players. Who do I bring in? Uh, let's bring in David Cuesta for Fresneda, who's on 6.2. I did not notice that. Fabuena for uh, Hugo Duro on a 7.3. Yeah, sure. Bartolome for uh, Naipan. Roberto Dominguez for Oscar Gluck. Still have one more sub, but I'm going to keep it just in case we have uh, injuries. Cuesta takes a throw in to Diomande. Here's a Cuesta again. Dominguez, lovely to Pabuena. Pabuena. 
back to Questa. Questa should have been playing at this level. Bartolomi! Huge opportunity for the youngster. We get a corner. Come on. Ben Doak is gonna take it. A good cross. Bartolomi again! Oh, the youngster is in good form. Came into the match with two chances. Right, I should sub off Ben Doak, who's really tired, and uh, I will. It was uh, suggested to me by my assistant. Rashford moving forward with the ball now. Ben Doak was there. Another good tackle from Ben Doak, but they still control the ball. An opportunity for Manchester United. Jimenez to Rashford. Saved by Resters. That was a poor shot. Yeah, let's sub off Ben Doak. Becerra is coming in. And that's all the substitutions I can make. Yeg to Luengo. Here's Bartolomi. He has space, a lot of space. Uh, look, uh, looking for Robust. Bartolomi again. Dominguez. Robust again. A good cross. Safe hands. No, it was a stupid mistake by Onana. And Luengo makes it 2 1. Come on. We change things around in uh, the second half. Even though Manchester United took the lead. Okay, it's over. We've won the match 2 1 6 1 on aggregate. It was easy getting past Manchester United in this quarter final. Marcelo Luengo, our best performer. We're gonna face Liverpool in the semi finals of the Champions League, and of course, that's going to be next episode. We're gonna play both legs, of course, and VARL. Until then, thank you guys very much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment. I'll see you guys for the next one. Oh,